George Clooney knew he'd found a soulmate in wife Amal when he realized she was the first person he'd willingly give up his life for. The couple met when she stopped by the actor's home in Italy with a mutual friend and there was an instant attraction that made one of the world's most famous bachelors consider marriage and a family in his fifties. George now admits there was something really special about the human rights lawyer that turned his life upside down. I felt that I met someone who I would absolutely trade my life for, the Ocean's Eleven star tells David Letterman in the TV personality's new Netflix show My Next Guest Needs No Introduction. I met someone that her life meant more to me than my life, and I'd never had that experience before, and I had some lovely people in my life. He adds, she, a mole, is sort of this remarkable human being and now mother, which is something I suppose you should assume she'd be wonderful at as well, but when you see it in person it makes you feel incredibly proud, and incredibly small. George, who was married to actress Talia Balsam from 1989 to 1993, exchanged vows with Amal in September, 2014 and the couple welcomed twins last year, 17. Clooney now admits that his bachelor days of parties, road trips and boozing with pals seem so far away now he's a settled family man. I don't drink, like I used to, he explains. It was never a problem for me. I've had a couple of bad weeks over the years. But I can have a couple of drinks and stop. When Amal was pregnant there was that sense that you have to have your wits about you. Before I had the twins, I felt that about her.